Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a ham and cheese omelet. And uh, the first thing you're going to need is a bowl, eggs, your ham, your milk, your grater so you can grind up the cheese, your measuring utensil, your cheese, and then a plate, a cutting board, and a knife. Now the first thing you can do is just measure out your milk in a quarter cup. Or you can use water. It's either one, either or. And then you can do how many eggs you want. I'm just going to do two because I'm not hungry at all. It matters how big you want your omelet. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not the best at cracking eggs. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's nasty. <laughs> Alright. Um, uh, Corny, can you get this towel? Alright. Make sure you have a towel in handy, because if you do a terrible job like I did <laughs> at cracking eggs, you're definitely going to need it. So you got your eggs, your milk, and uh, next you're going to need your ham, and for, well, never mind, I'll get to the cheese. And I'm going to cut this ham up, and I'm going to stop the video, and I'll show you when I'm done. Alright guys, so I got my ham, and I got my eggs, and I got my milk. As you can see, there's... Yeah, you can just, oh, there's the ham and there's the egg and that, yeah. Alright. So, after you get that in, you can either put the cheese in after you're done, like when you're like, like when the omelet's like already cooked, you can put the cheese on then, or you can put it in all the mix, but I'm just going to put it in all the mix so it's easier that way. And you just take your cheese, and use the grinding side and you just put some cheese in there. Yeah, that's good. Alright, so I got my cheese in here and now we're just going to mix it all up. And then once you're done with all that, you're going to start your stove and get your pan. And then I'll show you what it looks like, and I'm going to put it on the stove. That's what it looks like. You can see the cheese and the ham. And then put it on your stove, and uh, I'm going to stop the video, and I'm going to show you what it looks like when I get done with the finished product. Alright, see you guys. Alright guys, so when I was cooking it, I uh, didn't really flip it, I just scrambled it. So, I mean, okay. But this is the finished product. You can put bread or whatever you want on, I usually make it a sandwich, but yeah, this is it. Alright guys, Paul Nathan Allison, have a fantastic day. See ya.